Hello, my name is Bruce. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add formats and graphs to my financial reporting report. This is the sixth and final tutorial for designing reports with the Financial Reporting Web Studio. First, I want to add a logo and title in the header object. To make more space, I'll drag the header line. To move or adjust the position of objects in the report, we select the report object name in the Report Object Browser. To insert a logo, I'll click on the Add Object button, select Image, and then draw a box in the header object. Next, I'll browse for the logo file. For the report title, I'll click on the text button and draw a box next to the logo. I'll enter the rolling 12 period income statement title. I'll use the formatting tool to change the font size, center the title, and make it bold. Next, I want to change the orientation of the report to landscape. I'll navigate to File, Page Setup, and select Landscape. Lastly, I'll add a chart under the grid to make it easy to see data over time. I can change the chart type using several standard patterns. I'll change mine to Line. Next, I need to select which data rows to include on the chart. I want to include only the expense rows, so I'll select rows 3, 4, and 5. Finally, I'll format my chart to make it easier to read. I'll give it a chart title of Expenses by Period, a legend title of Type of Expenses, a metadata title of Period, and a primary axis title of Dollars. When I'm ready to see the changes, I can simply click on the Refresh Chart button. I'm done with all my formatting, so I'll save my work and preview the report using the HTML preview. I'll respond to the prompt and click OK. There it is. Thank you.